Hi guys, welcome along to Kettlebell Body Fit. I'm Ed. I'm Kerry. This is going to be an aggressive one. I'm just going to throw it out there straight away. Yeah. And it is. But because it's aggressive, we're only going for two rounds. Yes. Even so, welcome to Sweat School. Hello, it's going to hurt, it's going to sweat, it's going to burn, but it's going to build and improve. Yes. Fat is going to cry. Yes. That's called sweat. <laughs> <laughs> so, four exercises. I usually sort of 20s or 10 10s. Yep. Our transverse step swing. Yep. If you don't know any of these moves, go and check our tutorials out. Snatch to reverse lunge. That's going to be fun. Tick tock double. Super fast. Yep. And then gorilla row. Just to burn every quads. Yes, thank you very much for your feedback uh, on the gorilla row. We know it works very well for one of our <laughs> subscribers. So do subscribe to our, sorry about that. <laughs> do subscribe to our YouTube channel. We're almost at 100. And I said before we started, I'm going to regret it sometime. You are. When we hit 100 subscribers, I will do a whole circuit with the top off. Yay! I hear everyone saying, well, oh, uh, loser. But when we hit 200 subscribers, I'm going to do a workout whole session in my Monsters Inc. Sully onesie. This is going to really make him suffer. He sweats so much anyway, doing it in a onesie. And I don't know I why I've said that. I said it jokingly. I was like, no, that's a really good idea. That's also a stupid idea, but it's going to get you wanting to see me sweat and cry like crazy. And the ones he's wicked. It's really cool. So, anyway, do a jab at Facebook, Instagram, yes. YouTube. Please yeah. like, subscribe, follow. The workout. Let's do it. Transverse step swing. Let's guess. Number two. We've done, we've done this. I know, but I just kind of procrastinate because I'm really scared about it. <laughs> Don't be scared. Two rounds, 60 seconds rest. Yeah, let's just dive just into like it. Let's get on with it. Get on with it. Sweat out, water, ready. Dominant side, first of all. 10 10, that's it. So clean that kettlebell. Clean the kettlebell up into the rack. Make sure you've got enough space for when we step and swing. Are we clear from each other? I think so. Yes, we are. Right, in three, two, one, off we go. So there's the step out. And One. step back. Inhale, exhale. Importantly, guys, get that elbow back into your ribs. That's your rack position. Kettlebell tight, in close. This will mobilise through the old hip of ruse. Ten. Ten. Down to the ground to clean it up. So. As you guys know, now injury side, this one doesn't like for me. My hips do not spread as far in the. 12 o'clock, 4. 12 o'clock, 8. Clocks, digital, <laughs> lost. 3, 9. Not that many miles. <laughs> Let's try our best. Ready? Right. 3, four, 2, 1, off we go. The step, oh. one. and the swing. Oh. It does not want to for me. So as you step forward and drive those hips, guys, Four. that momentum, the power that you generate, will help get that kettlebell Whoa. back in position Seven. into the rack. Eight. Ah. Nine. Last Whoa. one. Ten. Ten. That's so annoying that that doesn't want to open up properly. If you can see my foot landing at three o'clock, it should be at four. If you can do that, sweet, well done. Or if you can't mobilise before we start, check out our mobilisation video. Snatch to reverse lunge. Make sure there's space behind you. Another return, we're going to step in. Back down to the ground. So back to rack. This is going to be a good one. Right. Ready, guys? One towards one. Three, two, one. All the way up. Lunge back in. Rack. Down. So it's a simultaneous move. <laughs> so important to keep the balance. Don't rush this one. As you explode Five. through the legs, they do the work. Six. Pull that elbow high. Seven. Oh, he murdered that there. <laughs> and the good thing is, Eight. going into the lunge. Gets you underneath that kettlebell easier. Ten. Oh. So in theory, you can go much heavier with your kettlebell because you're having to travel through less distance because explode up and then you're ducking underneath. Yeah. A little bit lifting, getting underneath the bar. Yeah. 
And then my heart rate has just kicked in from there. <laughs> non dominant side. Work on the balance. Thumb towards bum. Grip. Ready? Three, two, one, and snatch. Ooh, yeah. So don't worry if that was also awkward for you guys at home. So you can clearly see from the video that we are not lefties, we are righties. Right, drive those legs. Five. Keep the middle tight. Oh, bounce and shuffle. I bet it looks bad on the video as well. So you see the importance, guys, of taking your time over this one. Eight. So if it was tough for you guys at home, we've done 10 left, 10 right. Yeah. Maybe five and five. Yeah. As a starting. Even if it's too tough for you, take the kettlebell out, walk through the move. So you are just getting that practice. As Linford Christie would used to say, run the race in your mind before you get there. I'm sure other professionals do the same thing. Yeah, that was the other cool part, just to practice as far as mind. Everything going through yeah. until someone hits you. You didn't expect it to be. Right, so exercise three. Our TikTok double. Woo. It's fast, your heart rate will go crazy. Work it will open up your hamstrings. Drop to me first of all, and then... Yep. Right, so... Oh, sweaty kettlebells. Sweaty kettlebells. Here we go, so... Yeah. Three, two, one, the drop. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Woo! I don't know if you just enjoy that tiny little hair brush. I'm not as bad as what I thought it would be. But you can smooth the pace on that. Yeah. It doesn't have to be hyper speed. There's the heart rate kicking in. That makes it fun though. It does make it fun. That is a great move to do. And it's also a bit of a showstopper. What's going on there? How do you do that? It's cool. Right, so exercise number four before we take our 60 second break. Gorilla rows. So you get and hold into your squat. Nice deep squats. Deep squats are those quads. Like those Arr. quads will burn. Dominant side first of all. Yep. Ready? Ten rows. Three, two, one, go. So keep those abs tight, guys. Pull that kettlebell into your middle and slightly over your thigh. So the elbow's going back, so it's nicely on your biceps. On your ten. Little tight. Swap. One. Two. So your shoulders, Three. your biceps, Four. all those thighs are now being toasted. Keep your tummy tight. Don't collapse through your back. Eight. Don't roll your shoulders. Ten. Oh, and it's the stand. Yeah. So leggings working out. You're just insulating yourself. Yes. Look at the sweat. Um, I have filmed another workout before. Foolish! Actually, I filmed all the leggings for one of our shoots, yeah. and I did cook massively. And we're getting later into the year, so it's getting warmer. Oh, you're getting the legs next week, guys. Sorry. But said, 100 subscribers. Fair shape, wouldn't I? Let's say mine. If we get 100, or we could do bear look. So 100 subscribers to our YouTube channel. I will do one with my top off. 200. Oh, I'll do it with my onesie on. And I will do it, well, I've got the onesie that's um, Monsters Inc. Sully, or my Star Wars Chewbacca. Oh. It's got to be a Sully. It's got a little tail and a hat over there. He's brilliant. Right, let's come 60 seconds rest, guys. So, you should be hydrated. I have an inflatable Hulk suit. That might not be great for doing kettlebells. That could be quite difficult with the Hulk gloves. 
You shouldn't have told me that. <laughs> no, I don't have a whole one thing. I have a whole inflatable suit. That might not work. Ah, there we go. Hit a thousand subscribers and I'll do it in my Hulk suit. <laughs> Promise there. I've said it, it's out there. I don't know logistically how I would do that. I'd probably have to do it without the Hulk smash gloves on. Yes. I'm sure you think of things that don't involve too much kind of... <sighs> so, <laughs> there we go. My promise to you. 100 subscribers, we're only 29 away. Top off yeah. for a circuit. Go and smash that button, guys. Go and hit 200, subscribe. it's in my sunny onesie. And 1,000, I'm going to do it in my Hulk suit. <laughs> Stupid boy. Right, round two, the final round. So we're only doing two of this. If you do want to do more, guys, I know it can be a bit boring because you'll hear us repeat it, but go back, watch it again. Transverse swing with the step, snatch the reverse lunge, tick tock double, and our gorilla row. Ready? Let's do it. Let's do it. So, cat and bell is clean up into the rack. Long on the side step, three, two, one, go. One. So, as you drive your glutes forward, guys, it, how is that kettlebell away? Four. So your arm make contact Five. with the underside of your leg. Six. Your yeah. hamstring. Because if you step it, it accelerates Six. that kettlebell. Nine. Ten. <laughs> you hear that clear? I heard that clear. Yeah, that was me then. It's alright, I'm okay. It's strange. You'll pop. I should do a bit of mobilising before we start. Just a little... It's popped before. It's normal, actually. Yeah. <laughs> oh, my joints are pop. It's normal. <laughs> no, it's not. Right, ready? It is. Yes, it is. Dominant side to step. Three, two, one, off we go. One. Two. Out side. Three. Elbow in. Four. To your ribs. Five. That's the rack. Six. Locked in there. Seven. Keeping it. Eight. Nine. Nine. Ten. Ten. That's the rack position. Not this. Yeah, not, not here. Fitness professionals out there, that is not a kettlebell rack. Uh, Another little rack. <laughs> rack, lock it in. Even when you're doing just push jerks, etc. Hold back. Not here. You could dislocate shoulder. So I just think shoulder safety. So keep it nice and tight, nice and central. Thumb towards your sternum. Yes. Sits in nice. Not out there. So nice you can put a platform for it. Yes. No, 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 get over there. Oh, sit right there. Tick tock double. You ready? Um, snatch the reverse lunge though. Snatch the reverse lunge before. We don't want, well, obviously, somebody doesn't want to do this one. No. I don't want my left hand to be perfectly honest. Right, so here we go. Thumb towards bum for our start position. Three, two, one. Let's go up underneath the catch. Back to the rail. Down. So when we go into that reverse lunge, guys, try and stack. Knee. Nicely over your ankle. So take that big step back. That scene does need to bend as well. Seven. Keep your middle tight. Eight. That produces the torque, Nine. the stability, and I can transfer that power from the explosive drive from my quads and my glutes, pop it up, elbow pull, catch underneath. Do you see that one? Did you notice? Nobody noticed. Oh. Even I didn't notice. <laughs> So we're not going to talk through this one because we need to focus. You guys need to focus at home. For all you left hands out there, you can laugh at us. Yeah. So. Yeah, focus on. So left hand first of all. Ready? Three, two, one. See that balance? You just feel it toying with you. And that weight on the kettlebell, you need to stack it above That's seven. your shoulder. Really do have to focus. Oh, 
to get this right. No. To keep it safe. That's one. Oh. That's tough. So you can see when I cut all the stupidness out and be yeah. serious about that one. And I think as well, what I've just realised is we actually lunge on different legs when we snatch. So I snatch and lunge on the same leg. Oh. Didn't notice that at all. Um, I didn't that right. You can snatch and lunge back with the same leg. Nothing to say that you can't. I like balanced a little bit. Yeah. What happened?